Ooh, that is a roof collapsing overnight as the fire you see there tore through multiple oceanfront homes in Solana Beach, forcing dozens of people to evacuate. Yeah, 10 News reporter Marie Coronel live in Solana Beach. And Marie, firefighters have been there all night trying to save homes. Yeah, Jim, overnight they were out here. Many have left, but there is still the presence. Let me step out of the way and show you. You have the sheriff's department still out here and in the parking lot. You can see the fire truck as well as firefighters still there. But as you mentioned, aside from saving homes, crews also had to save pets overnight. We have two of them. Two of them. Uh, uh, it's really upset. And that's the moment firefighters rescued two cats that were left behind in one of those burning units. Amazingly, despite all of the flames, neither cat was hurt, but they were given oxygen and water as soon as they were rescued. The owner tells 10 News she is so thankful firefighters didn't give up on them. I knew they would be under the bed because that's where they go when they're scared. And so they were so nice that the firemen went back in and looked under the bed and found them. And right now you're looking at what crews were up against. Firefighters did their best to get control of the blaze at the Del Mar Beach Club. Uh, it took a lot of manpower and resources to try and keep this fire from spreading to other units. Meanwhile, the residents that live in or near that building, they were evacuated and some not even having much time to grab any of their belongings. Now back out here live, uh, we can tell you no one was injured. And as for the cause of the fire, that is still under investigation. We're live from Solana Beach this morning. Marie Coronel, 10 News. Thank you, Marie. A La Jolla mansion considered a hotspot.